Have you ever received a call like this? I'll set it up for 10 a.m. tomorrow. Uh, can I get your number to confirm the details? Sure, my phone number is 123. Got it. So, your number is 123. I'll send you the confirmation details soon. Looking forward to our chat tomorrow. Thank you so much. So today I'm gonna teach you how to build an AI calling agent. This is the easiest method ever. And with this project, you can potentially earn at least $1,000 per AI agent per month. So if you create 10, you sell 10, that's $10,000 per month. That's more than 100,000 per year. So that's really good. And everyone is trying to create these AI calling agents, but no AI calling agent has this quality. So let me show you how I do it. So this is the platform I'm using to create these AI calling agents. You can check the link in the description. With that link, you can try for free this platform and it will give you free credits. So it is really good. Try it. It's really good. So once you sign up and you are in this screen, don't go crazy and try the, the assistance. Probably you're gonna have only one. These are the other one that I'm creating right now. Uh, this is just for testing. This is my testing account, so don't worry about it. So the first thing that we're going to do to create an AI calling agent is a knowledge base. Really important, we're gonna create this AI calling agent and, and I'm gonna show you the result. So I'm going to actually call myself and you're gonna see the result. It's really good. It will be really good, I don't know probably it is so i'm going to use as a template another ai calling agent that i was testing for another uh company uh this is for a real estate company uh the one that we're going to create right now is for a landscaping company so i will copy that information the good thing about this is that in the knowledge page you can add actually documents of the company that you're trying to build the, uh, the ai calling agent and you can integrate this to another databases in the cloud like google sheets Airtable. uh and other actual databases so this is really good and you can take actions based on that call for example you can schedule a meet and that meeting will be saved in your google calendar so it is really powerful anyways with that uh information about the company i'll just go to chat gpt if you need this information just let me know in the comments and i will share it to you all right so for this landscaping company that we're creating the AI calling agents i will need the basically the basics of the company services estimation prices and others so ChatGPT will do the hard work for us we don't have to do anything if you want to rely on a really good ai just use grok which is better or ChatGPT 4.5 so once we have all this information we just have to copy and paste it in our new knowledge base so this is going to be landscape company just copy and paste that's it create and it is right here i'll show you why this is this is important and you have to do it first now we're going to go to our a assistance we're going to create a new one real quick so one thing that you can do is explore the templates and just copy and paste try to build it by yourself use the quick assistance setup it's really good because it's made with ai so it will do the hard work for you but what i would recommend as an ai automation specialist is do it by yourself because you're the only one who knows uh, that much about the about the business. Yeah, I, yeah, I won't get the details. You will. So I will create for this one an outbound campaign. I will not change anything here just for this uh, purposes. I'm gonna. Oh, I need to link the knowledge base. So right here, as you can see, it says knowledge base. We're gonna link the company information here. So as, as default, it will give us like a prompt. So you need to adjust this for the company you're creating. I will change that information with, with ChatGPT, but, but I will highly recommend you to do it by yourself because again, you are the only one who know that much about the businesses. And if you're selling this for another business, they will appreciate that you do it a really customized service. All right, so what I put in the prompt is copy and pasted the prompt that it was as a template in the other page. And I just say to ChatGPT this, but for our landscaping company, the goal is to confirm the address and the phone number. Why the address? Because uh, we need to get that address to go to the place and actually check what services we're going to provide and the phone number so we can confirm other services or whatever. 
now that we have the whole script, we just need to copy and paste it in our platform. So right here, there's a button that says edit prompt. We go here, we just paste the prompt that we have. Uh, greeting message, this is really good. Uh, you don't have to understand it right now. Uh, the thing is that you can create variables. So I will put name as a variable. So when you do a new call, the, the AI uh, calling agent will, will say, Hey there, Hermes. Hey there, Sam. Hey there, Smith. Hey there, whatever. So just put a name here so it feels more personal. Just save the prompt really quick. Uh, one thing that we can do is set up the voice. There are a few voices that you can use. This is really good. We have different languages here. So you can do it in French, Spanish, German, whatever. There are tons of uh, voices here. So if you want to edit the voice, just click on edit and you'll find the whole different voices that are in the in the, the platform. For this one, I will use a mail. I will use whatever. It doesn't matter in this case. It's just uh, for testing purposes. I will choose. I will choose. Uh, let's let's choose who. Ah, uh, Chris. So now that we have the voice here, our guy Chris is will do the calls. Uh, we're gonna test it so we do we click here in test assistant so right here you have to select a phone number you'll have to buy one uh so don't worry still it's really cheap it's like 1.55 it's just 1.5 dollars per month all right so uh once everything is set up just have to place your the phone number you acquired this is the number of the ai calling agent uh the third field is the your phone number the phone number you're going to call so in this case it will be my phone number uh remember this variable uh name so basically is the name of the person that the ai calling agent will call in this case it will call me so i put my name let's go so we're gonna test this ai calling agent and we'll see the result right Hey there, Hermes. Uh, yeah, hey there. Hey, I'm here. How's it going? Good, what about you? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. So, uh, have you been thinking about any landscaping projects lately? Oh yeah, sure. I need an assistant in that. Awesome. We specialize in the professional landscaping. What kind of project are you thinking about? I don't know. What kind of projects do you offer? No worries. We offer um, a range of services like design, installation, maintenance, and seasonal care. Is there anything specific you're curious about? Oh yeah, maintenance would be really good. Great to hear. Would you be interested in a free consultation to explore how we can uh, help enhance your outdoor space? A free consultation? Yeah, please, sign me up. Perfect. <laughs> Could you um, confirm the address we'd be working with? And is this the best phone number to reach you for scheduling? Yeah, this is the best phone number. And my address is Apple Street 123. Got it. Apple Street 123. Thanks for that. We'll reach out soon to uh, set up your consultation. Looking forward to helping you create an amazing outdoor space. Yo, thank you so much. You're welcome. If you have any more questions, just let me know. Have a great day. You too. Bye-bye. So that's our AI calling agent. It's really good. And again, you can sell this for at least $1,000 per month because potentially this AI calling agent can call hundreds of people. So it is really good. The quality is really good. All right, so that was the video. It was a really quick tutorial, so I hope you enjoyed this, you'll learn. If you have any questions, just comment down below and I will answer it shortly.